What's up guys, Pastor Andrew here, and I'm excited about Junior High Nights happening this Sunday, 6 to 8 p.m., right here at the Oaks. This is an on-campus small group with all the small groups coming together. We're gonna to be coming in through the youth entrance. It's gonna be a time of community, because here at Oaks Youth, we believe in community. Before cause, there's gonna be some food, there's gonna be some games, and then we're all gonna to come together, worship together, watch a bit of video content, and then break up into discussion. It's gonna be a great time, but I just wanna give you a couple tips coming in and a couple ways that you can have a win for this junior high night. So the first thing is this, text your students and invite them. On Wednesday nights when we had junior high small groups, it was 100% participation, but this is something that they have to come to. They have to make the ask, mostly from their parents, to get the ride here. So text them, because we want this to be in a huge moment of community. And the second thing is this, look through the content. This is different content than we're used to. It's a question answer format. And so go ahead and study it. Make sure you're ready to rock and you're not looking at it for the first time. Whenever you're in discussion, we've all done that before and it's, it is not fun at all. Or sometimes we just give it to you right before discussion and that's not fun either. So I know how it goes. But then the last thing is this, when you're leading discussion, as small group leaders, we've all experienced whenever we ask a question and there's no response. If there's ever silence, just try asking another question. Giving our own, own answers is never the best thing because we want students to self-discover the main idea of our discussion. So just try asking another question. We even have some secondary questions for each one to where there's another way to ask it if the first one didn't get a response. So anyways, y'all are gonna do awesome. We're excited about our first ever junior high night and we hope to see you there Sunday night, 6 to 8 p.m.